Hello everyone, it's Daniel here, and I'm, right now I'm under a bridge, and I'm on the Coles Hill property still, but I decided to stop here. Uh, I made a video a little while ago that was up on the top of the hill that measured where the uranium vein here comes to the surface. But I decided to stop under this bridge here, saw some big granite blocks, so, and right here you should, we shouldn't pick up any of the uranium. It's, it's about a half a mile up, about a third of a mile up the road so uh but i'm sure we could probably pick something off of these pick something up off of these granite rocks so it would just prove that even though you're getting some high readings doesn't mean uranium's around you could just have some granite so and i'll try my scintillation detector first and it's got a sodium iodide crystal in it so and that picks up gamma and we'll also try this detector that I recently got. Let me see if I can. And it's a two inch, has two inch pancake probe on it. And the needle doesn't work, just the clicks. So once I do that, don't pay attention to the needle. But the uh, the clicks are pretty accurate compared to other pancake probes. All right, so this is the first try my simulation detector. Let me see if I can get, kind of get up here to see if I can get a background reading. And background here is about 67 microrem. And right there it's in the the lowest decade. So it's about 9 or 10. But I'm also standing up in small blocks. So it's going to pick up those. But let's come down here to see these bigger blocks. And you can already tell it's increasing. I'm getting up under this bridge. Alright, let's just choose one. Let's see this guy right here. All right, that's just barely maxing out. That's about 25 or 30 microgram. Just barely maxing out my lowest deck eight scale. Let's see this big, big fella about the size of a car right there. Let's see what this is. Shit. Let's see the. I'll put it in the second deck eight scale. All right, that's showing about about 30, about 30 microgram an hour. See if we can find another block. Some blocks might be higher. I'm sure they're probably about the same. But we'll see. Let's see. Yeah, about 30. Let's see this one. That one might be... That's about the same. So yeah, all of these are... Roughly the same reading with my scintillation detector. Alright, I haven't tried this one. Maybe I have, I can't remember. That one might be a little a little higher than the other ones, not too much. Not enough to make any difference. Alright, so that's my scintillation detector. And that picks up gamma. And let's get this pancake probe right here. I just hit my head on this thing. Alright, let's cut it on. And again, don't pay attention to the needle. It just Let's see if we can get up here to listen to the clicks to kind of compare it to background. Alright, that's, that's the background. So, come back down and try her out. See what, what kind of stuff we can get. And this might be hard to hear because of the water, but I don't know. I'll try to put the phone close to the speaker to so you can hear. And that's uh, you can tell that's higher than the readings we were getting up at the surface. These are about the same. Whoop, that there. Let 
Yeah, all these are roughly the roughly the same. That one might be a little higher than the other ones. But that's not too much. And some it's, it's a lot of blocks through here. Sorry, my camera's not focusing good. But uh, yeah, it's a lot of blocks of granite through here, and I'm I'm guessing uh, those over there are probably the same. And I just figured I'd stop by to to show to show them to you. All right, and uh, I'm looking to get a Letla Model Three with a pancake probe. It'll be similar to well this guy. Uh, but it will have a, a handheld probe. And I'm also thinking about getting a scintillation detector for that also. Not a sodium iodide one, but because that would be kind of a waste to get have that and the the handheld sodium iodide crystal. But I might get a you can get pretty cheap plastic ones that do pretty do pretty good. You can get about a three inch plastic scintillation detect uh detector and it will work about as good as a one inch uh, sodium iodide one all right that's it